Hey, what's up, family? I'm about to make me up some um some crumbles. I said I was gonna make it with y'all. Uh, I got some um. Uh, turn my light on. I got me some um garbanzo bean flour. Got me some um uh, vital wheat. Got me some Worcestershire sauce. Some no soy. Some fine sea salt. Some onion pez alder. Some black pit pepper, some garlic pit pepper, some sunflower oil, got a little water. I don't even uh, measure this shit. I'll show y'all right now. I'm gonna pause it, I'm about to open my flour and stuff. I just pour some this wheat gluten. I don't measure it. I'm gonna make a big ball because I might save some, make some spaghetti. I'll go get my children. Oh, Ooh. fair use for that music playing, or I don't own no copyrights. None of that shit. I love you so. Now this boy, hold on, let me pause it right quick. Open this. this is the bazza bean flour. Damn. Yeah, I ain't measuring shit. I like the uh, old people say I cook, I cook in the spirit. <laughs> I just go with the flow, baby. I don't use no measuring. Well, I got a measuring cup right here, but I ain't about to measure nothing. I'm just gonna pour some shit in here. Pour it uh, It's gonna be like my little flavor for my seitan. That's just called wheat meat called seitan. Shit so good, it tastes like the devil, baby. <laughs> When I make it, that's why they call it Satan. Damn. Throw some water in here. Huh? Water and water don't mix. <laughs> right now, it does. Give me some scissors, not. I'll be shaking up. Some of that no soy. Oh, Give me another bottle. Shoot it up. Shoot, shoot, shoot it up. <laughs> Some Worcestershire sauce. Uh. Yeah, I ain't measuring nothing. I just let the spirit guide me. <laughs> there you go. Uh, the liquid smoke. Oh. Black pit pepper. I am pissed over. Damn. Damn. I'm about to mix this up. Let me get a fork right quick. I'll be right back. Back, my baby. I mix my little flour together so they can blend in right. Uh. The Sabbath, baby. Sabbath day love. Oh. All praise to the most, huh? Oh. Bring that up. Stuff easy, y'all. Y'all can make your own meat. You see they trying to poison us to death? See them burgers I bought? I'm going oh. I'm gonna shoot a video on um TSP. That's um, the trisodium phosphate. I know I don't never mess with no phosphates, and I used to put people up on TSP. But to see, they they just put the real name on there. I know it's some bullshit I don't eat, but I forgot all about TSP because I put that out here so many years ago. Years ago, like four, five years ago, that shit was all in your cereal and all 
all in, you know, it's all in everything, man. And look, I'm going uh, to pause it. I'll come right back show y'all. Yeah, here go the, um, the field row shit. Fuck field rows. But here it go. See, y'all got to watch out for this. Wheat protein isolate. Y'all got to look. And I looked up on the back of they, the hot dogs. I had some in the freezer. It don't say wheat protein isolate. But it's wheat gluten, trisodium phosphate, malic acid, and LCS team mixed together. So y'all better watch it. Trisodium phosphate. I thought, um... After I put this dough together, I'ma um, go show y'all a little quick video, like a three minute video about TSP. And it, they, and Phil Roche used that in they shit, but they tripping. I had talked to Amazon already, they like, they gonna have my, you know, have my money back. I'm like, shit, y'all better, for real. Wow. You know, that's terrible, man. I can't just, because I read it on Amazon, and, and, and Amazon had the right ingredients. It didn't say nothing about that. Maybe it said wheat protein isolate, but it didn't have it broke down like that. You feel me? But everything else I ate in there. It, organic expeller press, palm food oil, barley, garlic, it, Expeller pressed safflower oil, mushroom, sea salt, spices, celery seed, balsamic vinegar, black pepper, sataki mushrooms, porcini mushroom powder, yellow pea flour, culture cane sugar vinegar. I thought I was about to eat good. <laughs> That's all I'm like, ooh, this shit gonna be good. Uh, play me. Well, I'm, uh, I'm about to combine this, uh, my liquid right here with my powder, I mean with my flour, and I'll come right back after I make a dough ball with it. Yep, I put my water, now I'm just in here making the dough ball. Well, I put my oil mix, and the rest of that that's left, I'm gonna add that into my uh, my crumbles. You will be my oh, this is my part. This is the beginning of my part. <laughs> Everybody love this part. Here it comes. I might have to add a little more uh, liquid. Never on Sunday, Monday too soon. Just won't do Thursday and Friday. The week. Pour a little bit more of my. Saturday love. Oh. Sugar. <laughs> Sugar. That's my man, Alexander O'Neal, man. Anybody know me know that's one of my favorites right there. Go to another jam. <clears throat> yep, I'm about to bring this to a dough ball right quick, family. I'm going to pause it for a second, then I'm going to knead it for a second. Hold on. Here go my wheat meat. I'm about to wrap them up and put them in my steam pot. Let me turn this on. I already got my water in there. To, um, I'm gonna let them steam. I'm gonna come back and check on them. I'm gonna pause it for a second. I'm gonna let them steam about like 30 minutes, 40 minutes or something. Then I come back, grab them, then I'm gonna blend in time. Okay, family, I'm back with this video. Um, this dude, what's his name? His channel 411 Talk Zone Talk Zone Radio Show Channel. 
and he about to um I'm gonna let this only play for like um three minutes. Let him explain what um TSP is and why we should avoid this. It's terrible family. Welcome to this edition of the 401 Talk Zone Radio Show. My name is Leon Jones. Tonight's topic. What's up, Leon? Why is trisodium phosphate, known as TSP, added to the foods we eat? Let us know, family. Trisodium phosphate is an industrial cleaning product used as a degreasing agent, what? remover, and leave abating agent, and to clean interior and exterior walls before painting. Oh, shit! Is alkalizing cleaning properties. TSP was used in dishwashing soap and laundry detergent until it was phased out in 2011. Mm. The EPA found that it was harmful to the environment. The Clean Water Act, published by the EPA, lists TSP as a hazardous substance, while the CDC, known as the Center for Disease Control, mm -mm. recommends to avoid all Fair use for this video. Contact. The CDC Fair use. List these TSP ingestion symptoms. Abdominal pain, mm. burning sensation, shock, or collapse. Mm. Now, why is TSP used in the foods we eat? You heard what he said it do? Stomach pain. Hey, it go from stomach pain to you might just flat out collapse. A lot of people be having stomach pains and they be taking, when I was growing up, taking Pepto-Bismol and um, all type of over-the-counter crap that was killing me too just to ease that pain. And it was coming from probably this um, TSP stuff. I'm going to let him go. I'm going to let him keep talking. Well, TSP is most commonly used to reduce acidic nature of foods especially breakfast cereals, as it modifies mm -hmm. cereal color and aids in the cereals flow through the extruder. Now, other uses are TSP is added to meat to retain moisture during storage and cooking. See? TSP also... So we we be having meat and thinking we eating clean meat, and they be dipping it probably in TSP before you even get to you. That's terrible. I still got some flour on my hand. Yeah, they, that's terrible. And I, I, I remember I put people up on it. It was in the cereals and all that stuff. But hey, it's in the meat, all type of stuff. Let him keep, let him keep going. Leveling agent. That's a leavening agent to fluff up foods like cakes, mm -mm -mm. breads, and baked goods. So they using it as leavening, like you can, you can, um, you can read, um, um, read leavening on the back of packages and stuff, and it might be TSP, man. And then if it's blowing up cakes and stuff, what is doing to our bodies? That's why a lot of our bodies was blew out of proportion. It wasn't from just eating, cause fat people was out back in the day, but they wasn't as fat as people like as we is now. It's our generation. And TSP could be one of them. It is one of them things that was doing it. Let me let him keep going. TSP is also added to cheese to help keep its shape and melting properties. Mm. TSP is also used as an antimicrobial cleaner for washing produce. Mm. The tree is dipped in a TSP. So they're washing your produce at the store. You're getting your... um. Your good veggies and your, your probably at whole food probably everywhere. You getting your good veggies, they dipping them in TSP. That's why I'm about to get back on my gardens. I fell off last last year. I ain't do one. The year before, I, we had one, and um, the the year before that, I had one. I had a couple of nice gardens a, a couple years. Um, last summer I ain't do it, but next summer I'm gonna get on it. I'm gonna do more. Than I ever had. I'm gonna I'm a really get into it next year because they're poisoning us. You think we getting the good vegetables and stuff? And here they go with the TSP washing you, you're dipping your lettuce in TSP. <laughs> the solution to potentially kill all bacteria and kill you off with it. Why should we, 
as people avoid food that contains TSP. Now, TSP stands for trisodium phosphate. Mm, mm, mm. Studies have shown that ingesting high levels of phosphate, a major mineral in TSP, can cause kidney damage, mm. soft tissue, calcification, and removal of calcium from bones. Mm. Chronic high levels of phosphate intake can result in osteopenia and ultimately mm, mm, osteoporosis. Mm, TSP mm, mm. also irritates the stomach and intestinal lining as well as reduces lactic acid in muscles. What? Now what foods contain TSP? Breakfast cereals seem to be the products that contain the you heard all the stuff it caused? It caused kidney failure. My mom on dialysis. You know? TSP, all this stuff been in the food, high in for years and we didn't know it. But I I, I knew it. When I seen that phosphate, I know not to mess with phosphate. I just knew it. But I forgot about TSP, but once I seen it, I knew it. <laughs> I ain't eat no phosphate. It, it, it could cause all type of stuff he just said, man. Most TSP. Now, note that you may also see sodium phosphate, disodium phosphate. Yeah, that's why I say I stay away from all phosphate. phosphate. On a label instead of trisodium phosphate. These also cause the same problems as TSP. Uh, what I'm explaining to you all that this did occur. There's a cereal out. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to pause it, but hey, watch out for that false fate. Any, any version of it caused the same stuff. And y'all vegans, into that vegan life, y'all better watch what y'all eat. That's why I say I'm not a vegan. Even though I'm not going to eat meat, I'm still not going to be a vegan because vegans eat a lot of junk. And they be feeling high power. Yeah, I'm a vegan. I don't eat meat. You know that? But you eat in trisodium phosphate. So you got to eat, you got to eat, uh, you know, like greens and beans and, you know, green leafy things and stuff like that. Lentils and navy beans and stuff like that. You know, you got to, you know, eat, eat like how the most high wants you to eat. Eat how the creator I'm trying to eat to please the creator. Like my man, um, Minister Wilderness said, <laughs> he eat to please the creator. I don't want to be no, um, junk food vegan, but I'm about to pause it. I'm, gonna, um, about to pause it for a minute. And I'm going to unpause it after our, um, wheat meat finish. And I'm going to, um, show y'all the rest of the process. Okay, I'm back family. Here go, um, my blender. You go one, the other one in the steam pot. I'll just show y'all how I blend it up right quick. I use this. Oh shit. I use this. Bam. Take it to the top. I'm gonna break this up. Pause it for a minute while I break this because it's kind of hot. Okay, I got it on here. Let me get the. What you do? Bam. Taco meat in there. <laughs> yeah. Taco meat. Camera kind of gleaming off of it, but y'all seen it before. Just good taco meat. Oh, and I'm going to add, you know, my shit to it. Um, all the other stuff like I did the other day. Have it real good. And go on family. Well, um, that's the end of this video, family. One love, you know, and um, start making your own if y'all want to. You know, watch out, watch what we eat, family. They trying to trick us in a million different ways, man.